Welcome back to another hot sauce review. Today we are taking a look at the Serrano sauce from Yellowbird. And uh, we're gonna talk about how good is this and what's it good with. So stay tuned and let's eat. The very first Yellowbird sauce. I know Yellowbird is uh, quite a popular sauce maker based out in Texas. Um, I have not actually had any of their sauces before this one. This one was the first one I tried and I, I, I knew I definitely wanted to make a video of it. This is Yellowbird's Serrano organic version. I do believe they have a non-organic version, but all I've tried from Yellowbird, Yellowbird thus far is the their organic versions. So I'm excited to kind of talk to you about this sauce do the tasting. Mm. Very nice. So, I mean, I think I like the natural taste of Serrano peppers from what I've had so far. I really dig it. For heat, ah, this is tough. I think I'm gonna give it a two out of 10. It's got some warmth there from the Serrano peppers, obviously, but there's some other ingredients that actually kind of, kind of activate those Serrano peppers in the throat. Otherwise, it's a very diluted sauce with other ingredients, not necessarily diluted with like water or vinegar necessarily, but it's, it's more so, it's got so many other things going on and that are at play here that it's honestly not, not hot. In fact, I may even give it a one, maybe even one and a half, just to compromise. Uh, it's really not hot. Um, I mean, there is a warmth there from the Serrano peppers, um, mostly a little bit of a back throat burn, but if you're sensitive to spice, I would highly recommend this one. This one is pretty safe for most people. If you do have a lot in like large quantities, it'll probably spice up the heat a little bit more, but uh, this is a very manageable sauce for anyone. In, in terms of taste, it's a delicious sauce. I, I give it easily a four out of four out of five. Um, it's, it's really good. It's got some things going on that I don't know how I feel about, but like 90% of everything with the flavor and the taste and everything, it's just, it's really good. Um, this is, it's interesting too, because I don't usually love green sauces, but I would not hesitate to use this um, in any kind of green sauce situation. It's very tasty. It, you, you're tasting not only the Serrano peppers, but you're also tasting a lot of the vegetables that they put in here. They put in onions, uh, carrots, and cucumbers. And all of that you can really taste. Um, it's also, you're also gonna taste a lot of lime, so strong. Um, honestly, the Serrano peppers, you do taste them for sure, but they get balanced out by the other ingredients so much that this really feels like such a balanced blend sauce of so many different things. In terms of texture, um, I would say this is on the creamy side. It's, uh, it's pretty natural. It's not like thick, like a, a thick buffalo sauce or anything, but it, it, it does have it does have substance to it. It's not too watery. For versatility, I like green sauces with Mexican food, mainly tacos and burritos. I don't really use green sauces for anything else, so I don't know if this is the most versatile sauce, but if you like green sauces with other things that are not Central or South American uh, food, then you'll probably enjoy using this with other things, but I wouldn't use this with tons of other foods personally. I, I'm kind of picky with how I choose to use my green sauces, but it is a good versatile green sauce within the realm of Central and South American food. For health, this is where things get super, uh, super great, uh, to be honest. Not only is this a completely all natural sauce, uh, but this is USDA organic certified. Um, I mean, the ingredients are organic serrano peppers, organic cucumbers, organic onions, organic carrots, organic distilled vinegar, organic garlic, salt, organic dates, organic raisins, organic lime juice concentrate. That's it. 
uh, pretty much everything is organic and it is USDA organic certified, which is uh, always fun. Organic foods typically have a much more, uh, you know, much more aggressive and bold flavor profile uh, due to how they're processed. So I, I always like to try and uh, find some organic foods uh, because I experience organic, I I'd do organic all day if I could. Uh, organic usually has the best foods. So um, it is all natural, it is organic, it's also vegan friendly, it's gluten free and non-GMO. So pretty much any kind of health certification I could, you know, give it, it has. It's also BPA free. So uh, any, any environmental conscious uh, sauce buyers out there, this, um, this uses recycled plastics. So uh, this is BPA free as well. Honestly, you cannot find a healthier sauce than this. It does not get healthier than this. So, you know, in terms of health, you should have no worries or reservations about this sauce. Yellowbird nailed it. Uh, I'm really excited to try other sauces that they have. This is my first sauce that I've had from Yellowbird. I've already used it quite a bit and it's delicious. I mean, these sauce makers out in Texas doing, you know, great things with their organic stuff, being environmental, uh, environmentally friendly, making just awesome sauce concoctions. It's, it's awesome and uh, you should totally support them. So uh, yeah. You can pick up non-organic versions of their sauces, I believe, uh, but I'd recommend organic just because I, I personally like the flavor of organic more. Um, you, you can taste a difference, in my opinion. But if you enjoy the review, make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel for more content such as this. And I will see you in the next one.